Hey, I'm Carl with Aft, and we've got the Martin Logan Motion Vision X soundbar here today. And if you're somebody who has a great quality television set and you don't want to set up a surround sound system or you just don't have the space for it, this is definitely a great option here for you. Sound quality was really, really nice on this one, and uh, it's super simple to set up. Uh, we'll start with the way the, the soundbar looks. So it's got this nice piano black finish. It's kind of got this wavy design on the back, so it looks really nice. Uh, you have this nice cloth mesh grill on the front here to cover up the speakers. We did find though if this is going to be sitting in front of your television, um, you're going to need to prop your TV up a little bit because it will probably cover up some of the picture. It does though come with wall mounting hardware so you will be able to mount this to the wall if that's an option for you and something you want to do. Uh, connections, like I said, they're very simple. You have an optical input, you have a digital coaxial input, you have an analog input. There's also an ethernet plug on the back of this too. So a variety of different ways to hook this up. You can download the DTS PlayFi application onto your iOS device or onto your Android device and hook it up to your network so you can pull all that great music you have on your network at home and play it through this as well. So there's a, a variety of different ways you can use the soundbar speaker. It doesn't have to just be for, for television shows or movies. You can listen to your music on it as well through your home network. It's got some buttons up here on the top. There's your power button, your volume up and down, um, and then you have some selector buttons as well. Um, and then you also have a network button on the top so you can set it up to your home network so that makes it really easy. It doesn't have a subwoofer that comes in the box with it, but it does have the Martin Logan wireless transmitter built in. So if you have a Martin Logan wireless subwoofer, you can use it along with this soundbar to really give you a more robust sound uh, when you're watching your, your videos, your movies, your music, whatever you're watching. Um, on the inside you have three 1 by 1.4 inch folded motion transducers which are going to produce really really crisp sharp highs and then you also have four 4 inch cone uh, mid-range speakers built into this as well and that's all powered by uh, 100 watts of power so it's through seven, seven amplifiers that run power to all those speakers so you really get a, a nice variety of sound on this one again bass is a little bit lacking but that can be solved by hooking up a subwoofer you also do have a subwoofer uh, pre-out on this too so if you have a, a powered subwoofer you can plug it in here you don't have to use the, the wireless Martin Logan one that just makes it a little easier to set it up if you have that um, otherwise it's a pretty pretty simple design here. It, it looks nice. It's tall, like I said, so if you're going to have it in front of your TV, um, you got to be careful with that. It comes with its own little remote control here. This is pretty heavy. It uses a couple of AAA batteries here. It's got kind of a metal case to it, so it does. it's pretty substantial feeling. And then you have your controls, uh, all the controls that you'd find on the top of here, you're going to have on the front of your remote control as well. Uh, one little annoyance I found here is that it, it locks in with a Phillips head screwdriver. So to change the batteries, you have to grab a Phillips head screwdriver, take the screw out, put the batteries in, put the screw back in. It's just a little, it's a little more work than it should be to put batteries into a remote control, but not the worst thing. Sound quality really more than made up for that. So if you're looking for a great quality soundbar and you don't have space for a full surround system, this is definitely a great one to check out. It's the Martin Logan Motion Vision X. Make sure you click on the link below in the description to check it out on our website. And we appreciate you watching these videos as always. If you have questions, comments, please leave them below. We'd love to hear back from you. And remember to like and subscribe on YouTube.